Hey YouTube, this is me, Lexus. Um, basically I'm making a video, um, kind of documenting my brush reduction journey. I'm kind of late doing it. I get the brush reduction tomorrow, which is Friday, July 19th, 2013. Um, today is Thursday, but it's like 12 a.m. So, um, basically, I wanted to make the video, the video, so it was going to be more than one, just to kind of document what's going on, just to give girls what I was looking for, the truth, um, you know, the experience, my experience, everybody's not going to have the same experience, obviously, but, you know, just throughout this month of waiting for my surgery date to come, I was looking for nothing but brush reduction videos to look at to help me deal with what's to come. I'm really, I'm still, I'm nervous. I don't want to get put to sleep. I'm so scared to get put to sleep, but everybody keep reassuring me that it's going to be okay. Um, but that's my only fear right now. Um, so I guess I'll just start from the beginning a little bit. Basically, I always had big chest since I was a preteen, like 11 years old. They just came out of nowhere one day. I'm still not sure what's my exact bra size right now. I know when I went for my consultation, he said like I was an F, I don't know what, F something. I'm, I'm big, I'm huge. Um, so. They're big. Um, I wear two bras. I always wear a sports bra and a, um, a regular bra just for the extra support. Um, and now I'm going to be honest, I always wear two small bras just so it makes me feel and look smaller in my clothes. Even though I have the bubbles, I still prefer to wear the two small bras because I feel more comfortable wearing them. So that's what I do. Um, the, the bras that fit me, like my size bras, they always make me look huge. I just hate the way that they look. I hate the way that they feel. So I don't really like wearing them. So I'm going to admit it. I wear two small bras and I've been wearing them too small. The years. Um, my doctor suggested that I had the breast surgery, the breast reduction surgery, because I've been complaining about back, shoulder, I get really bad marks and scars. I mean, they're so heavy, it's ridiculous. I have back spasms. I've been on all types of muscle relaxers. They don't work, they just put me to sleep. Um, so, I'm ready. So, the surgery is finally tomorrow. I don't know exactly what time the surgery is, but they're going to be calling me to let me know sometime later on today. It is... It's 12.52, so... It's Thursday, July 18th. I get my surgery Friday, July 19th. Um... So yeah, so I'm like counting down the hours now, basically. Um, so I just there's gonna be more videos this time. I'm gonna try to make a video. I'll go see anyway. Let me go back. I go see my surgeon today at 7:45 a.m. So I really need to be asleep right now, but I'm up talking. But I go see my surgeon at 7:45 today. AM so just to go over things and talk about the surgery and everything and then you know tomorrow is the surgery so I'm gonna do an update video when I come back from the doctors and then I'm gonna try to get my fiance to kind of videotape what's going on Friday the day of the surgery just so people can get an idea and then when I come out of recovery I'm going to do a, another update video, probably from my phone. I'm at my laptop right now. And I'm just going to keep you guys posted and updated. I want to go down to a small base 
to a large base, small C. Um, cause I gain weight really fast on my chest, so I know I can gain the weight and they'll turn out to be a really nice size or whatever. So, it's, so I want to go really small, like really small. So, um, and then after the surgery at that hill, I'm going to be taking you guys on my weight loss. I mean, I'm not big, but I am a little chunky. <laughs> So it's time to like tone up. So I'm gonna be that's gonna be next. Um my daughter's still up. She's one, it's like twelve, one o'clock, she's up watching one. So that's what you hear in the background. She's laughing at me. But um yeah, so I'm gonna be taking you guys through this journey, just like a lot of other women and young girls took me through their journey and it helped me a lot. I wanna help people. So stay tuned, subscribe, and um, let's just hope for the best. See ya.